I started out in photography and journalism when I was in high school, like you guys are now. I was in a newspaper class, and so I was writing and doing a lot of photography. And eventually, I became interested in how you put words and uh, pictures together and kind of create narratives together. And so that led me into filmmaking. Um, but I wanted to have a broader focus in um, in the, all the different parts that make up the, f the film world and kind of different practices in filmmaking. And so I thought if I went to film school and learned some of those things, that I could use at least one of those um, as a way to get a job later on. And so I thought filmmaking had a lot of potential in terms of work. That's why I chose that over others. I also, as I said before, was very interested in how stories are put together with words and with pictures. I want to communicate through the videos that I've made. Uh, one, I think how extraordinary um, some journeys people take are, just how people make um, really great lives out of difficult situations or how people journey through their lives in very interesting, compelling ways. So I think one common thread in my films is actually has to do a lot with, with immigrants, refugees, migrants, people who travel through different cultures. I'm working on a film right now I'm calling Sailor Sufi Spy, and it's about a boat builder in Marin, right here in Sausalito, and he builds and teaches a craft of wooden boat building. So he's interesting because he does something that a lot of people don't do in terms of work, and it's an art form that's kind of dying in some ways. But he also has a personally compelling story. He grew up um, on the Pacific Ocean. His dad sailed boats between Hawaii and California, and his childhood was like literally on a boat. Um, and then when in his 20s and 30s, he was in Afghanistan for many years doing humanitarian work. So he was trying to get food and supplies to people who are in very, very um, tough conditions in the mountains in Afghanistan. He was interested in these sort of cross-cultural journeys, these sort of interesting journeys of self-development as well. Um, and <clears throat> Um, the film also asks, I think, some central questions about how you make things in life. How do you make, not just how do you make something like a boat or a craft, but how do you make a life? How do you make these journeys that have these risks involved in them and still come out on the other side thinking about things like, you know, like peace and, you know, love and justice and being very um, positive about life. If you're a creative person and a you know filmmaker, a journalist, anything in um, any kind of person in these fields, um, I think curiosity is kind of a basic. I think you know if you're curious, you're going to continue to be interested in different stories and different people.